Hello, hello. Today I'm going to show you how to make a clear reset your system of an Apple iPhone 15 Pro or 15 Pro Max. If you like to give a way trade in or you have a problem with your operation system with your iOS on the iPhone itself, uh, and the solution or the troubleshooting of um, clear reset on device itself does not make a solution for it, then the next step is make it with an external software. And this software is in this case iTunes. Okay, we will need to make this a uh, connection by wire that is a um, USB C cable data not uh, a cheaper one it has to be an um, um an, an good cable to make it good data transfer and of course the iphone and itunes and a computer system or a mac if um the um, the other thing is behind this is if you uh, reset your device itself on the on the device only that means you remove everything you make a clear setup again that means on this SSD is still an, op an operation system um, stored, okay? And if there is a problem with this stored operation system, of course, the, um, the, this is not a solution for the problem with your software because the broken software is still on your iPhone. But if you reset your device with iTunes, iTunes can download the newest iOS version and of course a good version which which works out of the internet and then it will be make a clear reset of this device this means formatted jobs done nothing is on on the um, iPhone and then it will be get a new iOS system installing on our device so after this 99% of all software issues are approved and gone okay how we perform this we will need our phone unlocked and ready we connect our phone with you with our computer and um on a computer the itunes is um running in the background and then we can go to it and read what's going on on the screen okay here the connection is done we see this iPhone icon, we tap on it, and now we can see that is an iPhone 15 Pro. We see here the iOS version, and we can update the system if a new update is available. This is a good solution for thumb problems. And or, in our case, we have a problem still with the iPhone, so we restore the iPhone. But before we can do this, we want to back up the settings for the iPhone before restoring the software. You can choose backup or don't backup. But a big thing is behind this is if you have an able uh, where is or find my, then you will get a problem with resetting the device that means first before we can perform this we have to go back to our phone and on our phone we have to switch off this process because if we does not do that we will the new uh, um, maybe maybe you will give it away and then the new owner will get a problem with it and we cannot make a clear reset the system so we are now getting back to our phone here we are okay we go to settings then we go to our apple id in the upper side then we go down to find my find my still on we have to switch this option off to a clear um, to clear everything turn off the system and now find my is turned off as you can see so now we can continue here we are we go back to itunes on the screen and then we can make it happen that we can make the clear ba uh, backup if you like or we do not backup the system 
So then another um, information comes. Are we sure we want to restore the iPhone? All our medias and other data will be erased, all the newest version, and then the newest version of the iPhone software will be installed. And this is the big thing behind this. The new version, which does not have a problem, will install to our device, restore and update. Now, next, and here we are. Now, the, the process is, um, is in go mode and after it downloads the iOS it will be um, get onto the iPhone and after 30 minutes or something you will have a new iOS installed on it of course you will have uh, you have to make a new setup and after the setup you um, most of the time this is the, um, the solution for your uh, for your uh, issues with your with the uh, ios and so on and uh, most of the time you fix the problem after it thanks for watching please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback and i hope to see you again on my channel soon soon